Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a walkthrough of Teacher Max and Ross. So I've been really craving going and finding what kind of like body care stuff is there. I'm just like so curious as to what they have now that it's like almost summertime, pretty much the end of spring. Just really wanted to go and explore what they have. And I think I'm not gonna buy anything. I'm gonna try not to buy anything, but I just really wanna show you guys what's out there. And I always find these videos a lot of fun just to see what's kind of showing up in other people's stores too. So I hope you guys enjoy, but let's go ahead and head on into the store. All right, guys. So starting off with TJ Maxx first. And yes, I did do this walkthrough before Mother's Day. <laughs> Don't judge me. Okay, so first we had a ton of awesome like gift sets. There's a little spa set with like a little headband and some, I think it was like um, face mask and stuff. And then we do have this Philosophy Amazing Grace Kit with a shower gel and I think it's a body butter whipped body cream actually. It was really, really nice looking. For only $23, I think originally would have been probably 40 or something. And then another one of those gift sets. We had the face brush set. They also had these cute, cute, cute Betsy Johnson accessories, little hair clips and earrings. And they had this huge bath, um, like caddy that you can put over the bathtub. Oh my gosh, that looks amazing. And then we do have a vanilla mousse eau de parfum. This is $11 and it is, I think, the smaller size that they have. And then we do have a ton, a ton, a ton of perfume sets. This little Smashbox set for $15, which I doubt it goes for $51, but it's definitely more than $15 regularly. I can't see the brand of this, but I think this is Toka, if I'm not wrong. Uh, Liliana perfume for $10.99. It's a small one, but it looks really luxury. And then we do have this Coach Travel Spray set. They had honestly so much perfume sets. It was like kind of crazy and a little overwhelming. Um, and then I found an Aeropostle set, which was really surprising to me. And then this one was really, really nice. Lay Jet set. And it came with a ton of different perfume fragrances, which I think is a really good tester's kit to see if you like it all. And they did have the pink sugar candy uh, shower gel body lotion, and I believe that's the perfume, all for $30, which I think is a good deal. Um, I still have yet to try pink sugar. It's on my list to try, though. But they had that set, and then I did find this, like, um, some random. We got Guess Girl. We got Jimmy Choo, which I show that one a little bit later, actually. It was a perfume set. And then I kept looking at this Korean skincare item. It's a coffee milk body lotion for $5.99. I found some more stuff from this brand a little later in the video. And then I did find Love, Beauty, and Planet there. Um, a set of hand creams for $5.99. Not a bad deal. It's really good. It's like a dollar each. And here's that Jimmy Choo set. Um, and now you can actually see it's all their perfumes. So I think that's a pretty good deal. And I believe it was, what, $50? $60, actually. I don't know what this brand is, but oh my gosh, it was so pretty. And then there was some more philosophy. This is Pure Grace Summer Moments. So that was a good find. And I think this is a very large size perfume bottle too. And then Clinique Happy in a large bottle for uh, 60 bucks and the Pink Sugar for 20. And then we did have the smaller version of Clinique Happy and I found Burberry for her, which was only 35, which I believe would be probably 60 originally. And then I've been finding so much Mix Bar lately. This is $12.99 for the Tangerine Squeeze Perfume. And then this huge section of just totally random body sprays, perfumes, like anything you could think of. They had so much of it. And then again, more Pink Sugar, more of this brand in Latte de Coconut, which I bet that smelled so good, but I did not get to smell it. I always feel odd um, having these things like out and not in packaging, but oh well. We found another one, Acai Bai, which I'm pretty sure would smell like berries for 20. And these are like much larger. And I did find a four pack of towel scrunchies, which I've been really interested to try. I honestly should have picked these up. They're only $6 for a four pack, which I think is pretty good. I did find the like whipped body butters in um, this one was in Unicorn, which is $8.99. They had the peach one for your booty. It was a butt butter. And then Mermaid Kisses. I'm really interested in those. I have to try them one day. 
and then some spring fling, rose and aloe body scrub, and then a bunch of more stuff. Um, I did find this Kopari Coconut Latte Body Wash, which now that I'm reading that, I should have picked it up. Oh my God, I'm so mad. Okay, St. Tropez, they had a ton of it. Self-tan whipped marshmallow, and this was $16.99. It is like an exclusive one in the scent whipped marshmallow. And um, I did also find the Coppertone Glow uh, sunscreen, but this is a hydrogel sunscreen, which is something I'd never heard of, heard of before, but it sounds really cool. Um, found some Soap and Glory this time, which I don't find that often. Often, And this is a scrub for $5.99. They did also have this um, different body scrub, but in a tube, also $5.99. And a Kopari scrub in Coconut Crush, which is always good to find. And then we did have a Onyx Bathhouse Hot Mess body scrub. This random like e.l.f. Um, skincare kit, which I thought was really cool. Pacifica Glow Baby Body Peel for $2.99. I should have picked it up. I'm so interested to see what that's all about because it's vitamin C. And then more philosophy. We found white pear. And this is a smaller size for $6.99 of the shower gel bubble bath. And then I also found it in vanilla coconut. I really need to pick up something from them soon. And then I did find these cute little donut, um, I think they're soaps, right? Yeah, they're little um, bath fizzies actually. And a I Do Care mini trio of little face masks. And I did find some Clinique. They always have a ton of Clinique. And these giant Mario Badescu bottles, which I don't know if you can tell how big they are, but they are ginormous. I've never seen the, them that big before, but they do have lotion, which I did not know about. Some more of this Korean brand. This is Coconut Milk Body Cleanser. So I think that's a shower gel. More Saint Tropez back there. It's a bronzing water gel, you guys. I don't know what that means, but it looks really cool. I would be scared that I would not be able to see myself putting it on my skin though because it's clear, but that's just me thinking that. And they had so much sunscreen, you guys, so much. And then I did find this little duo of a strawberry body scrub in a vanilla bean body butter. I just thought this was genius to put a body butter and a scrub together in one pack for only $10 makes them $5 each. I just thought that was really cool. And the packaging was just adorable. And then, uh, what do we got? We got some more sunscreen, sun bum cool down. This one's supposed to like be cooling on your skin, which I do love those, especially if I'm going to like the beach or something. And then we had Pacifica sport sunscreen with probiotic technology. Ooh, I didn't read that before. And then I did find more philosophy. This is lemon drop martini in the smaller size and a giant vanilla birthday cake. Oh my God, it looks so yummy. That one did smell really, really good. More of this Korean brand. This is a banana milk. I can't even read it that fast. I think it was lotion, but banana scent. I don't know about that. I'm not the biggest banana fan. Let Your Dreams Blossom, Rose and Aloe Exfoliating Body Scrubber $5.99 from Body Prescriptions. Let me know if you've tried Body Prescriptions before because I have not and I'll have to know how those body scrubs perform. But I did find some Hemp's Body Lotion. There's another one right there. This one's like the age-defying one. Yeah, age-defying, which I thought was pretty cool. Some more hemp stuff just like kind of hiding in there. I did find this Stars and Stripes apple scented body scrub. I've never seen this brand before. Didn't even think they'd start putting 4th of July stuff out yet, but there it is. And then a coconut scrub from Onyx. We love Onyx in this house for $5.99. More San Tropez next to that. I just didn't pick it up, I guess. I didn't see it. A Shea Moisture Shampoo Bar. I have been so interested in shampoo bars. Let me know if you guys have ever tried them because I would be actually down to do that. I think it's so much better for the environment than those big plastic bottles. Some more perfumes. This one's new, Miel Bebe. I don't know how that one would smell. A Beach Vacay Foaming Scrub. That one looks yummy. And then more self-tanner stuff, the Sunless Tan Applicator Mitt from Kula for only $3.99. That's a really good deal. And then candles. I did find some candles. So Village Candle Coconut Pineapple for $12.99. I think it's a great deal for this giant jar candle. And then I always find these Sand and Paws um, candles. They had a bunch of different scents and stuff. I didn't actually get to smell it, but they're really cute. Sandalwood and a Musk from DW Homes. They had a ton of DW candles here. 
um, this week when I went. And that one was $12.99 for a pretty large candle. And there's Palo Santo. That's a smaller one for $7.99. Relax Essential Oils. And then, oh, there's white linen. I bet that one smells really good. That's a tiny, tiny, tiny one for $5. And then, oh my, big mama jamma birthday cake. It's freaking huge. How much was it? $20? Okay, worth it. That thing is huge. Are you kidding me? Oh my God. And it smelled really, really good. I remember that. Okay, we've got Summer Sunset over here on sale for $6. Not sure why it's on sale. Maybe it was a return. Um, wild honey and nectar and then a fresh lemon one. So they had like a little section of summer candles. Okay. We transitioned to Ross. I did not, <laughs> I didn't do a good job of introducing that, but here's the Ross stuff that I found and they did have quite an extensive body care section. So we've got love beauty and planet. Um, there's Corez up there, dove pistachio cream and magnolia. Oh my gosh. That sounds so good for $6.99. I'm not quite sure how much those um, go for regularly, but here is the avocado oil body wash and then the giant um, tubes, tubs, whatever of these, Sakura Blossom for $8.99. Oh, a Paradise Girl Philosophy Tropical Fruit Colada, Fruit Colada Shampoo Bath Scrub. That one's huge too. I did find Dr. Bronner's Hemp Almond Pure Castile Soap. This was $7.99. I don't know if that's any different than the price it would go for in like Walmart or something, but I did find the Gentle Exfoliating Body Wash. I really love that formula. It's actually really nice and gentle, um, but still leaves you feeling squeaky clean. And then some more Dove. We've got Glowing Ritual Body Wash, which sounds really cool. That one's $49, much um, smaller than the other ones. Diamond and Lychee Body Wash from Nivea. And then they did also have some sunscreen here as well. Some Neutrogena, Hydro Boost, Wet Skin, and even some Copper Tone for babies. So really good finds. I did find Crispy Marshmallow Bars. I should have picked it up. Oh my God. See, I put it in my cart, but I didn't actually buy it. It, mm, it looks so good. I already showed Paradise Girl. I don't know why I'm showing that again. Um, and then I did find another... This one's apple, or no, white peach and white tea. I'd never seen this Dove body wash before, so let me know if you've seen it before. But um, I think this is $10.99, right? Oh, $8.99? Oh, that's a good deal. Okay. And then we have some sprays. Um, this is actually a Hemp's foaming body wash, which I thought was a really cool formula as a foam. We do have Ariana Grande, Thank You Next, which has clearly been sprayed before. Um, Ariana Cloud perfume. So they had a ton of little body sprays here. They really did have a lot. They also had Sweet Like Candy from Ariana, more of that Hemp's stuff, and even some like spray deodorants and little mini perfumes, Oscar de la Renta. Wow, I just realized that's what that was. <laughs> and then here's a little mini scrub duo. It's a foot cream and a body scrub. Oh, foot scrub. So that was cool. And then a little lip kit, which is a lip scrub duo. And another lip scrub duo, which I thought was pretty cool. I've never seen this brand before called Bare Touch. So that looked fun. And the Dove bath bombs that everybody's been finding at the Dollar Tree. I found them here for $4.50. So definitely a better deal at the Dollar Tree. And then I found some random Disney princess stuff. This is Cinderella body spray and lotion, which was just the most random thing ever for $7.99. That's a great deal for like your little daughter or your niece or whatever. I think that's adorable. And then a Calvin Klein a little perfume set, $27.99. Not bad, not bad. They had these headbands. They're gorgeous and they were on sale. I should have bought them, honestly. I don't know why I didn't. And some cute little clips. They always have nice hair accessories at Ross. I will say that. And they had tons of loofahs and scrubbies and anything you could think of. They had so many dry brushes, like Oh, everything. They had everything. They had little back scrubbers. They had some big loofahs back there. They had dry brushes. Just, oh, so many good things. They even had little like nets too. This little cotton scrubber, which I love these things. They have a little handle on them. Perfect to put your body scrub on. They also have the gloves, which I personally don't like because I don't like my hands feeling wet like that. But if you like that, they had them there. They had more towel scrunchies here. There's only a two pack though for $3. So I think the other one was a better deal. But yeah, they had so many good loofahs and everything here. I always get my loofahs from TJ Maxx or Ross or Marshalls because they just come in a pack for such a cheap deal. 
and more dry brushes. And I did find this Conair set of rollers. There's only five of five rollers in the set, but like perfect for thin hair, $25. Really cool because I know rollers have been back in style. And then I did find this clear jewelry eye organizer for 13. I just thought it was really adorable. And hey, there am I. And then this is actually right next to the checkout line. They had a huge section of perfumes, which obviously they were trying to keep from getting like stolen. They have them in all their little packages. Um, more mix bar. There's a little scent discovery kit, which I thought was awesome. Great deal for $8. Um, more Disney princesses. This is the Belle perfume for $10. Really cool. And more Ariana Grande. They had so much of that and more Elsa for Disney. Okay guys, that is gonna be the end of the walkthrough video. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know down below if you guys like these walkthroughs at like Ross, Studio Max, Marshalls, things like that. Let me know and I can definitely do more of them, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe down below, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.